What's up, boners? <laughs> Hello and welcome. As promised today, we have the new Grave Digger Skull. Ooh, spooky boys. Look at that, look at that little guy. Look at that. Ah, get away, get away, get away. Anyway, quickly grab my items. They're both terrible. Doesn't matter. Let's grab our buff and make our way down and begin the gravy run. Very quickly, before I get into it, if you didn't see the last Skull video on the Monkey King, go see that one if you don't know about the update that came out, which has all new quintessences, maps, the two new Skulls, and an update to the Prisoner. Very important that you go check that out before you watch this video so you understand a little bit more about some of the new things that we have to play with. But anyway, let's get into it. The Grave Digger. You can find spirits wandering around the world. A tombstone rises when a spirit is defeated. You need a tombstone nearby to use this skill. Now the wording on that's a little bit funny, but basically you need tombstones nearby to use your abilities. When swapping, two tombstones appear around you. Thank you. Free tombstones. And we can call upon King Lear from the grave. King Lear throws iron beads at the enemy, dealing physical damage. This skill can gain up to three charges. So, I can see my little King Lear down below. I, however, cannot use him. I need to kill some of these little uh, spirits that wander around or swap in to summon King Lear. The best way to to, uh, to show this is to just do it and uh, actually summon him. Um, let's go King Lear. I'll summon two of them down here. Huh, two, two Lears down here. And they... Yeah. There's no more enemies nearby, so now I have to come up here and start bashing dudes to make some trees spawn. Yes, King Lear. My Lears. My Lears. Get them, my Lears. Uh, those trees down below are as good as dead. While I bash these guys. Yep, they're, they're gone. And that's kind of the way that Grave Gravy plays. He is a power skull. He has a tackle dash, as you can see. Oh no. But, you know, I don't think it's a big deal for him, seeing as how he's... Such a cool dude. And he also has this incredibly heavy hitting, heavy swinging um, basic attack that just, just, uh, uh, look at it, it, it's so chunky. You can feel the chunkiness and the weight behind that coffin that he's swinging around. Uh, take that. It's important to note that at the common level right now, um, He's very shallow, there's not too much that you need to worry about. It's just, you know, smash dudes, summon little summonables whenever you can kill the little, yeah, little skull spirit dudes, which I'm not going to lie, it's going to become my greatest addiction to uh, King Lear. Oh, oh, King Lear. I'll stand over here and wait for Lear to take care of the rest. Thank you, King Lears. <laughs> Reminds me very much of the Carlean Recruit in a way when you can summon dudes. But these guys last a lot longer. They're still here. Um, they can't move. They are stuck in place. In the shop, I have been given a bit of a gift. Gold Incense Burner and Carlean Insignia uh, together. I am going to do my best to get both of these, I think. I'm willing to get rid of the Quartz and the Draft Stone. I wouldn't mind holding on to... Um, Ring of Wind for that attack and movement speed boost for the little Power Skull fella. But getting double money items off the bat is very good. I really wish I could get that sword though. All right, starting off with Skull, we're going to wait. We're going to swap out as soon as this fight starts and we move over into your new location. Oh, no. No, stop it. King Lear. King Lear. King Lear. Triple Lear. Bully her, my kings. Bully her. Bully her, my kings. Throw stones at her. Stone the witch. I mean, she's not really a witch, but still. I'm going to go on the other side of her and start knocking her back towards my kings. Look at them throwing stones at her. Uh, she's dead. What do we have over here? Ooh, I see pike. I see steel golem. And I see diorite circlet. Now, as cool as it would be to take steel golem and start throwing out some big mechanical fists, I really do need to start getting some bone fragments ASAP to get this guy upgraded for you. Um, we saw a little bit of stone golem last time in the previous video for about all of what? 30 seconds? <laughs> Let's upgrade gravy. The gravy train continues to flow. Undertaker. You can find spirits wandering around the world. When a spirit is defeated, all skill cooldowns are reduced by three seconds. Very important because his cooldowns are a little bit on the lengthy side. When swapping at five tombstones appear, and King Lear more or less still does the same thing. He uh, throws iron beads at enemies. So moving on, um, I'm really looking forward to going into unique and getting my second skill because pretty much all of the grave diggers 
um, abilities are the same idea. You're summoning kings. Well, not kings. You're summoning uh, dudes to fight for you. Wow. Alchemist is sitting here ripe for the picking. Even if I don't keep him and use him because he has a magic skull, I can uh, destroy him for bone fragments. We have the Cretan Bull, which is pretty handy and would work for our build. But I'm looking for... Yes, here we go. <laughs> I was going to say, I'm looking for some Kylian stuff so I can benefit from uh, the Insignia some more. Am I going to be able to get this bow, though? I don't think I can. Oh, wait, no. If I sell the Coward's Cape and the Draft Stone. Give me the, give me the bow. I want, um, I really want to get some money coming in. The new Unstable Quintessence is also over here with Overload, 12 second cooldown. When you use the Quintessence, the Overload causes an explosion that deals physical damage and has a 50% chance to reset the cooldown. Okay, Yggdrasil, I have a favor to ask. I'm not exactly confident that this is going to work, but I want to ask you to please, yes, allow tombstones to- <gasps> It fell off! to appear on your tree branches so that King Lear can throw things at you. Wait, yes, summon him there, summon him there. Yes! Get him, my kings. Get him, my kings. Look at him go. Get him. Get him. So they, they, they're hovering in the air. <laughs> they're hovering in the air. They don't care. They're hovering in the air. No. That last king, please. All right, I'm gonna swap. I wanna get new tombstones to show up, so I'm gonna swap into Alchemist for a second. Do some smooth dodges. Leah. All right, we've got a good Leah. At a nice, uh, what would I say? A nice elevation for attacking Yiggy right in the face. Because the other ones, I don't think, are reaching. If I were to summon them, let me try one more. Nah, he's not doing anything. Look at him; he can't reach. Lower your chin. Oh, there we go. He did! Ask and ye shall receive. Thank you, King Leah. High five, dude. High five. Give me something amazing. Give me something amazing. Coward's Cape. I've had two Coward's Capes and two Draft Stones. I need new items. Let's come down here and upgrade our Gravy Train into Unique Status. Is that a double coffin? The Soul Bearer. We can still find spirits wandering around, but now enemies have a chance to rise as spirits when defeated. So even if you're not lucky enough to have some spirits nearby where you want to fight, just kill a few dudes and, you know, at least one of them should show up as a spirit. When a spirit is defeated, all skill cooldowns are reduced by three seconds and a tombstone rises out of the ground. Still need a tombstone to use skills. When swapping, five tombstones appear around you and the land around you becomes the land of the dam for 10 seconds. Enemies in the land of the dam take magic damage over time. Land of the dam. I like the name of that. Land of the damned. <laughs> King Lear is still called upon from the grave, still throws iron beads, but we now have access to Macbeth with that chunky 33 second cooldown. Call upon Macbeth from the grave. Macbeth slams the ground, dealing physical damage. This skill can gain up to two charges. Now let's check out this Land of the Damned. Ooh, yes, that is definitely a Land of the Damned. And now let's summon some Macbeth, who slams the ground. Look at him go, throwing a tantrum. Look at him, look at him. And uh, we'll summon a King Lear. King Lear is more or less doing the same thing, but I think he's throwing faster now. So uh, we have access to a second summon. Um, the skill cooldown thing is very handy for us to have on killing little dudes still, because we want to be able to actually use our summons. And I think if they didn't have this cooldown reduction thing in place, whenever you kill the little spirits, it would be a nightmare trying to balance the cooldowns on them. It would just be unreasonable. Is that the Slam King? No, no little Slam King. I don't have a broken item yet. I wanted a really strong, powerful item before you showed up. I forget what room I'm in. Am I in an item room or a skull room? I need to go to the end and actually see what's available before I commit to slimy. Can you die for me, please? Get slapped. Uh, the clown box. I don't want it to mimic the clown box, so we're going to leave that there. Come over here, and I guess cross my fingers, hope and pray that it turns into one of my uh, insignias or my, or my gold incense. Um, the magical slime is a new NPC. He transforms himself into a random item in your inventory. And he turned into Coward's Cape, so we now have two Coward's Capes. I mean, who knows? Maybe that stacks and makes it into an incredibly overpowered and really useful effect. You don't know. I don't know. You don't know. I'm going to swap back into Alchemist for a second. <laughs> Cry for a minute, but mostly just so I can summon the Land of the Damned. Summon my King Lears. Summon some Macbeth. More Kings. 
more kings, more leers, and just get all the summons on the screen. And now, yep, the room is clear. <laughs> the room is clear. I'm going to kill off some of these little spirit dudes to reduce my cooldowns so that when I move into the next room, I have some dudes to watch. Look at all of them here. Man. And I got the armor. Awesome. We're getting some money. Macbeth. King Lear. Macbeth. King Lear. Oh, it's amazing. Look look at this. Look at this. Why do you need... You don't even need to do anything. You just need to summon a whole bunch of dudes and then let them do the work for you. I mean, the mage up here is going to miss out, but we can fix that. Harpy. Give me bone fragments, Harpy Lady. Thank you. All right. In the shop. Ooh, we have Ninja. I haven't had a good chance to destroy Alchemist yet, but Ninja does sell for more than <laughs> an Alchemist. So I'm actually going to take Ninja. Um so that I can sell and get more back from that. Another draft stone. Is this, is this reality? Another draft stone, really? The new Ifrit, when you use the Quintessence, Ifrit causes a firestorm that deals magical damage and creates a path of fire. The path lasts for 15 seconds and deals magic damage. Yo, look at this dude. Look at him. Look at him sitting there on the, on the stand looking all important and stuff. Oh, what a cutie, I like you. Oh, he's got a friend coming over. It's my turn on the podium, Larry. Okay, we found some Prayer of Grace, increasing cooldown speed. Uh, for someone like Gravy, who has so, so many long cooldown abilities, I think increasing his cooldown speed might be very, very necessary to keep his flow going, to make sure that he doesn't just run out of steam really early. Um, I forgot that I had ninja for a second there. Let's do some ninja-y things real quick and wait for the cooldown. There we go. And we'll summon some Macbeth here, summon some King Lears, summon a Macbeth over here, some more King Lear. Let me, let me, oh, 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 don't do it, lads, don't do it. Oh! So they're doing really big, powerful slams at times. Okay, there seems to be an effect where they're powering up somehow. I'm not sure how or why they're powering up to do better effects. But they are. Um, okay, the pauldrons isn't a bad item to be given. I want to get rid of the coward's cape. I, I, I don't think two coward's capes is really doing anything for me. It's kind of booty, and I'd like to get rid of both of them anyway. So I'll get rid of one of them, and I'll get rid of the other one soon. <laughs> I'm not keeping them long term. I'm not keeping them long term. All right, we get more King Lears out. More King Lears. More King Lears. Maids are coming out. It's 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 actually kind of mean. Hang on. Macbeth. Get the maid. Get the maid, Macbeth. Get him. Get Oh, Beth. Okay, adventurer fight. You have no idea the kind of hurt you're in for right now. Land of the Damned. And then we summon Macbeth. We summon not one, not two, but three King Lears. Yes, that's right. There's that many King Lears in existence. Are you frightened yet? I need you guys to move over here, and yes, yes, sit next to Macbeth and the Kings. Die. My shield's protecting me. Whoa! Yeah, yeah, look at the size of these giant iron beads, by the way. They're doing, like, empowered moves at times. I'm not sure why, but they are, and it's amazing. Over here we have Water Skull. We have Cyclops, the new Cyclops, Pride of the Giant. When you use the Quintessence, the Cyclops slams his fist down and deals physical damage to nearby enemies, and you receive 20 shield. Okay, we don't have a Quintessence yet, and I haven't seen this, so let's take it and have a look. The minute cooldown is a bit expensive sounding, but... Oh, Nah, nah, I like that, I like that. And a shield as well. A 20 shield, no less. Yeah, let's go. Look at him. He has no idea that he is about to receive the fist of the Cyclops. That's a pretty tough little fist right there, I'm not gonna lie. Did I just call it a little fist? I just called the Cyclops fist a little fist. It's literally enormous. Still a tough little fist though. I'm stalling, I'm stalling, I'm stalling, I'm stalling. Land of the Damned. Macbeth. King Lear. King Lear. Tackle through all of that. Uh, more King Lear. I want another Macbeth. More Macbeths. King Lear is throwing balls all over the screen. Balls all over the screen. Yo, they're actually destroying all of this. This is insane. Uh, another Leo? Nah, I'm just gonna- I'm just gonna walk around. I'm gonna go and kill dudes and get my cooldowns back. Because my, uh, my summons are taking care of business for me. That's incredible. That's incredible. This is kind of busted. 
Um, Skeleton Pike. I'm also going to ditch Ninja and take Pike so I can get those fragments now before I uh, miss out on potentially getting them. Yo, yo, Fist. Big Fist. Summons. Leer, Leer, Leer. It's also really good having that, that shield because it takes a moment to summon my goons. And if the shield is protecting me while I can summon my goons, I mean, I'm not taking damage. It's just really good. No, no, no. I need tombstones. Quick, Leah. Okay, Leah's just gonna sit there and throw balls at her. She can't... She's not doing anything. Because I'm not in range, she's not fighting. Look. Look. Oh, you poor thing. You got cheesed in the worst way. You got cheesed by King Leah. Ah, uh, look at these items. Look at the skulls on display. Look at this. Look at this. Clown. Okay, Clown does go for more than Pike. So we'll take Clown and potentially destroy Clown and try and get those fragments. Another draft stone. Why is draft stone following me? I'm cursed. I'm cursed. Stop giving me all of these things. Sage's time. Um, no. Sage's time is a bit rough for this right now. Oh, oh. Okay. Clearly, Forbidden Sword is a terrible idea to have with Gravedigger because of how slow he is. But do you think I care? I see Forbidden Sword there. I'm going to take Forbidden Sword. I'm going to drop Big Cyclops Fist and summon the Land of the Damned. I'm also going to come over here, slap this dude a bunch. I'm going to summon Macbeth, more King Lear, more King Lear, and I'm going to let them take care of it while I come up here and knock this guy down. No. Get on the ground. You will- Oh, he got knocked right to the ball! You will also suffer the same fate. Smash. Oh, it's time. It's time. Are you ready? Are you ready? It's time. Follow me, lads. Lads, all of you, follow me. Follow me. Follow me. I, I wish- I wish to bunch you all. Alright, Land of the Damned. Cyclops Fist. We summon a Macbeth. We summon a Leer. We summon a Leer. We summon another Leer. We summon all the Leers. Uh, put a Macbeth over here near this guy. Um, I need more cooldowns. There's there's another Leer. Another Macbeth. Another Macbeth. Macbeth. Yep. I uh, need more cooldowns. Need more cooldowns. Another Leer. Another Leer. Yes. Yes. Okay, I just walk over this way. Follow. 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 Look at all the little dudes over here. Cooldowns galore. Tombstones. It's a graveyard. More like graveyard. That's incredible. When this, when he goes off and starts summoning, he goes off and starts summoning. Unfortunately, even with Warrior's Destruction, we can't, we can't get enough. And it hurts so bad. On the plus side, we're going to destroy these ladies as a way of uh, making it up to you. Land of the Damned. Let's summon some King Lear all over the screen. Since King Lear's range is ridiculous. I'm also going to drop the hammer, and by that I mean big Cyclops fist. Oh yeah, lady. Did you really want to be over there near Macbeth? I wouldn't want to be over there near Macbeth. He hits hard as hell. He's brutal. This, this is actually pretty cool. Like, like it's just, it's ridiculous. Um, I'll put Macbeth over here. I need to swap out though, I need to swap out. Um, I can't stay as just... Um, just gravy the entire time because I need to summon some more land of the damned. There we go. Smack, smack. No, you need to die. No, you have to die. Can you... Not you, you're the wrong sister. You are actually the wrong sister. King Lear. I'm not getting many spirits showing up though. Are spirits just... There we go, there's another one. I want more spirits. Uh, Big Fist. More King Lear. More Macbeth. Smack, smack. No, no, no. Where's... Oh, she got run over. Okay, I was gonna say, where is the girl that I need to get rid of who has low life? Uh, Land of the Damned. Macbeth, King Lear. What are you gonna do about it, huh? What are you gonna do about it? There's nothing you can do about it besides perish. King Lear. I don't... It's, it's, it's actually... If I just make her come over here next to Macbeth, you're just going to put yourself in danger constantly. Another Macbeth. Yeah, that's it. Oh! She got rocked. She got rocked, slammed, and buried. I would say rest in pieces, but there's none of you left. What do we get? Jagamon Thorn? Um, no. <laughs> Jagamon Thorn is a big no. Okay, moving right along, straight into Act 3. Summon the Land of the Damned. King Lear, King Lear, King Lear. Yes. Yes. The Learys. 
the King Leary's. I'm going to summon a Macbeth right there because as soon as the tree is spawned, tree is in danger. Tree, you're in danger. Oh, get some tree. Cyclops fist. Oh, it's pretty fun. It's pretty fun. The cooldown is a bit long, but I understand that the reason the cooldown is long is because it also gives a shield. And if that was on a shorter cooldown, that would be a little, a little too good, maybe. Get in that. Get in that. Get in that. Get in that. Die. What do we get? What do we get? Hunter. Um, I'll keep clown. So we'll let, we'll let Hunter be destroyed. We have our fragments. Excellent. We're ready. I'm going to swap into clown really quick here, though. And let me summon some Land of the Damned. But I'm going to summon Land of the Damned up here. And then come down here and summon a Leary. Leary. Macbeth. Leary. Macbeth. Another Leary. Okay, you guys are... You guys are really actually as good as dead down there. Um, my King Lear is still over here throwing balls. Actually, the balls are rolling down into that pit. Oh, that's a problem for you guys. Cyclops Fist. So tell me, what do you guys think of Gravy so far? And I don't believe you. Is that five? Six? How many draft stones is that? No, go away. Go away. This is a cursed run. This is a cursed run. Let me summon some King Lears here. Let me summon... Actually, no, I'll save Macbeth for down on the lower floor. Uh, uh. Are you summoning him? You actually summoned him? You monster. Give me Macbeth. Macbeth is going to smash this guy for me. Thank you. Oh, they were doing the summon because the balls must have rolled down and, and activated them. And triggered them. That's fine. That's fine. We've got the power of Macbeths and King Lears. See? In the shop, another hunter and... Ooh. We have Arc Demon. We saw what Arc Demon did last time. Um, unfortunately, we're not going to take it today because it's magic and doesn't suit what I want. I would like to see that Shadow Knight shop, though. But in the meantime, I guess we'll take Brawler's Knuckle and replace... It might be time to replace the Ring of Wind. I'm doing a lot of summoning and not as much swinging anymore, so maybe we'll just do this. I would take the Hunter's Wooden Longbow, but without big critical chance, I'm not really worried about it. Instead, let's re-roll. Find the Cretan Bull again. No. Re-roll again. No. Re-roll again. Finally, the Giant's Axe. This is what we want. I think it's time to replace the Kylan Armor. Thank you for playing. Thank you, thank you. I'll see you later. We are closer now than ever to obtaining Legendary Gravy. Summon the Land of the Damned. Uh, you know what we need to do? King Lear. King Lear. King Lear. Giant Fist. Macbeth. Macbeth 2.0. I gotta come down here and fight these guys. Wait. King Lear. You can deal with that. Wow. Upstairs is already done. Um. It's kind of ridiculous. Oh. King Lear just killed all those guys down below as well. Okay. Third adventure of fight. We're getting closer to legendary gravy. Ladies. Gentlemen. We're gonna summon the land of the damned. King Lear. King Lear. Giant Fist, King Lear. Put a Macbeth here. Uh, in the corner, this lady is stuck. Can I get a Macbeth in the corner, please? Yes, I can. There we go. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Oh, it's, it's, it's balls, slams, balls, and more slams all over the screen. He got stopped. Might bully this guy first. No. Ow, ow. I'm in a bad spot. I'm in a bad spot. Get out of there. Get out of there. Smash him. Smash him. Summon King Lear. Uh... They're not really near where... Oh, wait, 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 wait. Macbeth. Slam her, Macbeth. All right, now we've got the problem. You, lady, are out of range. All right, you've, you've always been a problem. And you're continuing to be a problem now. Fist, can you please... I swear. Thank you. King Lear, King Lear. Quick, 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 Macbeth. Quick, slam her. Get her now. Get her now while she's low to the ground. You guys can't reach, can you? They still can't reach! Ah, oh, lady. You're a problem. You know that? You're an actual problem. Land of the damned. Yes! Get on the ground. Get her, Macbeth. Yes! Alright, moving along. What are we... Ooh, we have Mummy. We have the Nias. The new Nias. When you use the Quintessence, Nias grows several ice flowers that deal magic damage over time. 
the ice flowers explode when destroyed, dealing magic damage to nearby enemies and freezing them. As cute and cool as that sounds, I don't want it. I want money instead because I've already got access to my legendary grave digger. Where are all the physical quintessences? I want to see more of the physical quintessences. Where is Centaurus? Where is Orc? Without further ado, it's time to obtain the legendary Gravy Digger. That's not even a coffin anymore. At this point, he may as well be swinging a car. Savior. You can find spirits wandering around the world. The enemies have a chance to rise. The spirits when defeated, same as before. When a spirit is defeated, all cooldowns are reduced by three seconds and a tombstone rises out of the ground to deal damage to nearby enemies. So, so very quickly, where's a dude? Oh, thank you, a volunteer. Now, whenever you kill the little guys, they explode when the tombstones come out and they do damage. Very handy when there's a lot of them all over the screen. We now have even more area damage. Land of the Damned. When swapping, five tombstones appear around you and the land around you becomes the Land of the Damned for 10 seconds. A number of spirits appear in the Land of the Damned and enemies in the area of Land of the Damned take magic damage over time, Land of the Damned. King Lear, call upon King Lear from the grave, up to three. It sounds like whenever you use the ability once, you have a chance of getting multiple King Lears on the one button press, which would be really amazing. He still throws iron beads, still has three charges of the skill. Macbeth, call upon Macbeth, up to two, same deal. Uh, still slams the ground, still has two charges of his skill. So I want to see if I can get this to work. If I, yep, there we go. I pressed it once and I got two King Lears. So we now have a chance to summon an army of goons. An actual army of goons. All right, land of the damned. Look at all the spirits. King Lear, King Lear. King, look at all the King Lears. There's so many King Lears. Macbeth, there's double Macbeth upstairs. Oh, dude, that's busted. That's, that's ridiculous. Look at all the spirits. Look at all the Lears. Wow. Wow. That's a lot. Just for swapping in. Look at the spirits. They're already here. King Lears. Happy to see you. Macbeth. How you doing? No. Big fist. More King Lears. Oh, King Lears. Get him. Yep. Yep. I could see that coming. There's so much green on the screen. There's so many spirits. So many victims. And I can just get my cooldowns to reset by killing them all. Another money room. It's also worth noting, I don't think I mentioned it. We've got three in Miser, which uh, is not what I expected whatsoever. I didn't think we'd actually get three in Miser, but here we are. Big money room. Um, I'm going to break all of these and try and kill all of these spirits to try and boost our Kyrian meter. Um, we're at 203 kills on Kyrian already, which is pretty good. Macbeth. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh, Leah. Big fist. Smash him. Wait, they're all dead? Item is the Mana Eater. After using a skill, the next normal attack deals an additional physical damage. I mean, I don't think I really need it, but at the same time, it's damage. We'll get rid of the Kylan Insignia. I'm making a lot of money right now, um, which is really good, but I know I just said we had three Miser, but I don't need three Miser long term because I'm not going to focus on a second skull. I'll be taking item and money rooms. We should be fine. I need to get more uh, raw damage built up as opposed to just making money the whole time. Macbeth. No, no. Lots of explosions all over the screen. Come up here, smash that. King Lear. Come over here, smash that. King Lear. Um, you guys got this, right? Do you need me? Do you really need me to do anything? The ball's rolling back. The ball's rolling back. Actually, I will destroy him and get my cooldown lowered. I actually have a sneaky suspicion that, that Gravedigger might be really, really strong and, like, kind of busted in a sense. Um, in the shop, we have... Ooh, wait, we have Imp. More magic summons a trio of pranks to Imps. The Imp trio will move around freely and deal magic damage to nearby enemies. When you use the Quintessence, the Imps will be summoned to the player's location. I have seen Imps already. Uh, basically, the Imps just run around constantly and do damage. Little bits of damage to nearby enemies. Nothing major, nothing, you know incredible. So I've re-rolled a whole bunch and I have found what must be the sixth or seventh draft stone. I, I actually like, I despise this clone stamp though. Give me something good. Double execute. Eh, not bad, but no. Um, oh, here we go. Thorny boots. We have something. Something. Finally. Get rid of the, uh, the bow. I want more physical damage. But where is the good stuff? Thank you. There it is. Thieves black steel dagger. 
that's what I'm looking for. Let's get rid of the gold incense burner. I don't want to lose all my money completely, so we're going to move on. But we got something. We got something. Okay, I need to. Wait, no. I want to go down and fight. I got to get my... Um... Oh, I've got to get my Forbidden Sword leveled up. I totally forgot. Wait. He needs killing. Quick, kill him. All right, my King Lears. I have the utmost confidence that my King Lears will take care of that. Yes, they did. Perfect. Went exactly according to plan. Yo, look at all the Macbeths. Look at all the Lears. That's busted. That is so... This is busted. Why is this allowed to be a thing? Sup, dude? You just, you just sat here chilling? You hanging out? <gasps> look at that little zombie ghost there. Look, look, look. Little ghost. I see him. Do you see him? Rude. It's time to turn this graveyard into a graveyard. <laughs> <laughs> That's insane. Look at that. When you've got... Because the enemies have a chance to just become spirits after they die. You can get so many... Look at all the graves! You can get so many spirits and so many graves. And they all just... They explode as well. No, I don't want thief armor. They explode when they get destroyed. So it's a lot of area damage. All the Macbeths. All of the, the King Learys doing so much damage. That's ridiculous, dude. That's ridiculous. All right, Chimera. I'm just a lowly little clown. Come to say hello. Do you do you do you want to psych? Jokes on you. Jokes on you. I'm actually a grave boy. Welcome to gravy. Uh 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 uh. Whoa. Whoa. Settle down. Summon more King Lears. Wait, I'm at the back. I've never been at the back over here before. Well, I have. Just not recently. He's almost dead. I can just stand here. Wow. I wasn't ready for it to die yet. I was still summoning dudes. Wow. Okay. Okay. Uh, Chimera's Poison Fang. No. I don't want Chimera's Poison Fang. Stop giving me these items. I mean, it's a bit of a testament to how decent and how just downright fun Savior is that I don't need a bunch of really broken items. I think the strongest item I've got right now is is now well now it's Kyrian, now that Kyrian's activated, but Thieves Black Steel Dagger, I think, is the strongest thing outside of that. What's up guys? How you doing? Fist. <laughs> Fist. Uh let's run over here and summon the graveyard. King Lear. King Lear. King Lear. Lots of King Lears. Let's put a Macbeth over here. Why not? Um A bit overkill, I think, because they're all gone already. Uh, I should actually not be so quick to spam out lots of summons and be a little bit more selective with my summoning, maybe. Do -do 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 -do. Do -do 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 -do. Land of the Damned. Do -do 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 They're dead. Look at that. Look at that. They're gone. They're gone already. They're gone already. What up, dudes? Follow me. Follow me. Hello, ma'am. Macbeth. King Lear. Another King Lear. I'm going to put a bath over here. We're going to smash these. Summon another King Lear. Oh my god, dude. That was disgusting. That was disgusting. Look at them all. That was disgusting. Now I don't have any summons left for up here. I've been a fool. A damn fool. That's okay. I've got... Apparently I've got great damage either way. Yeah, apparently I'm just smashing. Yeah, all right. All right. In a flame. Come on. The game is just being mean to me at this point. It's being, it's being peak rude. I shouldn't have summoned. Why did I summon? I need to summon down there. I do need to summon up here though. Oh, it's the little girl. It's the little girl. Macbeths. Get him. Um, my Macbeth army will take care of this. Thank you. Little girl. Oh, little halfling girl. Yeah, yeah. Good friends. We're great. Is she going to give me the same thing? Oh, it's different. What's this one? Moonlight Herb restores 25% HP. Aw, what a sweetheart. I'm going to leave that there for a second. Hang on, hang on. That's better than the Love You one. Oh. 
So she just gives you lots of healing stuff. I wonder if you have a chance that she just says, like, you know, you're ugly, I don't like you. Here, take this take this flower that, that does damage to you instead. She'd never do that, though. Look at her. Look at her. She's got a bird on her head. She'd never do that. Moonlight Herb, thank you for that. Shop, shop, shop. And we have Master Fighter. Thank you for giving me a good item for a change. I love it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Our health, by the way, is looking so good. Our survivability is so strong. I think it's time to shake that up. Let's get rid of the uh, the pauldrons and worry a little bit about... Hey, that double execute clone stamp came back. And worry more about getting our damage up. Aha, here we go. A little bit of gunpowder sword. Synergizes beautifully with our Thieves Black Steel Dagger. I'm going to ditch maybe Mana Eater. Um, I'm not utilizing Mana Eater properly. I don't care. Get rid of it. Do one more reroll and find trash, unfortunately. Up here we have the new Wraith with the Gates of the Netherworld. When you use the Quintessence, the Gates of the Netherworld open and create a fissure that deals magic damage. The gates are destroyed after 15 seconds and deal magic damage to nearby enemies. Another magic damage Quintessence. I can't win with this. I really can't. The game is just like, yo, have all the quintessences. All the magic quintessences. Land of the damned, son. Land of the damned. King Lear, King Lear, King Lear. All the King Lear. More Macbeths. Uh, I just want damage on the screen. I just want more damage on the screen, dude. Explosions. Everything's dying. He's off the edge. He's dead. No, no. Don't do it. Don't do it, daddy-o. Oh, he fell and died on his own. Um, incredible. Incredible. Aw, oh, yeah. Aw, oh, yeah. Land of the damned. King Lear. Macbeth. King Lear. King Lear. Um, keep going. Keep going. Keep doing it. Keep doing it. Quick. We need to... We need to... King Lear. We need to get rid of these guys. Get the others to summon in. Why are you over here on your own? Quick, big fist. Macbeth. King Lear. Wait. Ah. Macbeth, wherefore art thou my Macbeth? Uh. Oh, look at all the summons. The damage, the carnage, the chaos. Don't come over here, dude. I've got an army over here. That, they're all dead. That is insane. That is insane damage. Prince's box with Manatech and Endure. Yo, Manatech would be really handy if I had found broken mana engine at some point, that would have been amazing. But just note that if I had found some mana tech and Wisp, yes, the new Wisp Quintessence, that would have been amazing for this. That would have been insane. Try Wisp with your... No. Oh, I was so excited and happy and now I'm just so disappointed. Land of the Damned. Oh, look. Wow. Hang on here. Let me... Let me summon my King Lear real quick. Um, look, King Lear, Macbeth. Oh, wow. There's nothing I can do with it. I mean, I can sit here and smash it with my, uh, my giant weapon. Yes, yes. Get him, get him, get him, get her. Get her while she's weak. Get her while she's, while she's suffering. No, don't do it. Do you have any idea who I am? I am the Grave Man. Macbeth. Macbeth. Continue to mess her up. Summon another King Lear. Oh. Put Macbeth there. Yes. Do it. Beat her. No! Get back on the ground, lady. Uh. Yeah, that was still way easier than the uh, warrior run. So, Savior is definitely, definitely a better power skull than most power skulls in the game right now. Imp again. Look at all this magic. Look, Stone of the Air magic. Imp does magic. Alchemist magic. I can't, I can't win. The game is determined to give me- Oh, look at you all queued up there, sitting on top of that little stand. You just gonna, you just gonna sit there, little dude? You just gonna stay? Okay. Alright, you stay there, dude. You stay there. You're, oh, you're cute. Wee! I'm gonna run all the way over here and summon the land of the damned. Macbeth. Leah. Macbeth and Leah. More Leah. Big fist. Macbeth. Macbeth. No, don't do it. Beth. Die. More King Lears. More Macbeth. Um. What? Uh, it, is it all gone? Is, is it just the statue left and these dudes over here? Wow, okay. 
Smash them, I guess. I didn't even see some of the other enemies that normally spawn in this room. They must have just died as they appeared. Land of the Damned. King Lear. Macbeth. King Lear. Yep. Yep, it's about right. Yep. Right, this item is Pain and Despair. Uh, you know what? Pain and Despair is better than nothing. I may as well take it. Um, I, I still kind of want to keep Prayer of Grace, but I also want to keep Kalan's Sword, so I guess... What's more important to me? 25% damage. Well, plus courage. That's more than just 25% damage, actually. You know what? I don't want, pra I don't want Pain and Despair. I'm just... I'm not going to make that choice. I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. It's not for me. It's, it's not for me. It's not my place to say, all right? Land of the Damned. King Lear. King Lear. Macbeth. Yep. Yep, they're all dead. Y you only need to do like one Macbeth and maybe like one King Lear. I, I don't... I don't quite understand why it's so good. Like, Macbeth is hitting so hard. The idea that you can summon three of him... Come over here. Get in the way of Macbeth's big slam. Look at that. Look at that. Get him. He, of course you did. Of course you did. I'm just gonna beat you up myself then. Ooh, land of the damned, King Lear, Macbeth. Don't do it. Don't do it, you fool. I'll summon King Lear on you. La 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 la. Land of the damned. Summon it all in. Beat them all up. Beat them all up. Yes, kill them all. I'm being reckless and I don't care. Give me a good item. More magic? Why is it giving me more magic? Yo, Predator. Um, oh, 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 Balrog. But you know what? I will. I don't want to, but I will. I'm sorry, Cyclops, but I will. Um, I'm going to ditch Clown for a minute. Let's grab Predator just for that power synergy. And let's do some rerolls and try and find some good stuff that I swear. I have done so many rerolls. I've used up so much money. And I couldn't find a single item that was worth taking. So I'm going to come over here and get a slice of cake instead, you know? We're going to get cake instead. And I'm going to move on. And just and just be depressed and sad. Because, because video game decides, you know what? No. You may not enjoy. But, but you, know, you know what's more than that? What's more than that? Hang on, hang on. I'm, I'm bothered now. So let's, let's activate Balrog. And I'm going to wreck this guy real quick. Come into here. Ugh. Fire everywhere. Fire. That's right. Enjoy this. I've only just noticed now, by the way, that Balrog is actually benefiting from Kyrian, so maybe the best decision I could have made was taking Balrog. Dark Priest Robe. You know, get rid of the get rid of the get rid of the Grace. Get rid of the prayer of grace. I don't care anymore. Land of the damned. Summon Macbeth. Summon Leary. Uh Can I get more Leer? Can I get more Leer? Thank you. I'd like more Leer over here. Thank you. Thank you. Look at all the big baths. Look at all the baths. No, tackle you. Yes, destroy this thing. Okay, cruising on over into the Joan fight. I've got to be smart about this and lay at least one Macbeth on each uh, one of the, uh, the pillars. Try and get some King Lears maybe in the middle of the room so they can throw either way and get rid of some of these little enemies. There's going to be a lot of summoning going on. I'm looking forward to that. Uh, summon the land of the dam. Activate. Oh, oh, oh. A lot of Macbeths there. Uh, King Lear. King Lear. A little dude exploded on me. Statues are all over the screen. I can't see anything, really. Kill this guy. Summon Macbeth right there. Uh, more King Lear. Wait, one's already destroyed? Yo, those three Macbeths over there really went to town on that on that pillar, didn't it? Oh. Oh. No, don't. I'd like to not take stupid amounts of damage right now. I'd also like to keep my cooldowns relatively low. I want... Yeah, I mean, I'm going to just smash this now anyway. Um, can I quickly come over here and kill some dudes and get some cooldown back? Yep, you, you as well. I forgot to swap. I need to swap and get some... Oh, that time slow down, though. All right, we're going to come up here. Land of the Damned. King Lear, King Lear, King Lear. More King Lear, more King Lear. All the King Lear. No. No, get them, kings. Get them, kings. Wait, why am I in there? Uh, summon another, summon another King Lear. You know what? Balrog. Brrr. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, final shop. Let's go. Ooh, Berserker. Oh, is that, 
Is that- oh, it's a rear blast. Finally, something decent. Weapon Master. Oh, the new Weapon Master. Nice. It's a shame it's so late for you to show up. When you use the Quintessence, the Weapon Master shoots forth a countless number of weapons dealing physical damage. The number of weapons summoned is based on the number of enemies. Well, seeing as how we're about to go up against one enemy at the end, I'm not going to take Weapon Master just yet. Oh, look at him sitting up on the podium next to Berserker. You're such a cutie. Instead, I'm going to come down here and I think just buy Rear Blast, you know, get something going. Um, Kyrian is going to help trigger Rear Blast constantly. Uh, let's get rid of the Dark Robe. Get rid of all of our defense. We don't need any defense. So we're going to go in with all offense. And it's that time already for me to say thank you for being here at the end of this new Grave Digger run. Um, I hope you guys have enjoyed seeing what he's capable of doing. I'm actually quite thoroughly impressed with how how unique and strong and useful he is. I was worried that, you know, oh, there's a new power skull coming in. Um, I, what if he's really bad and not good? But I, I'm actually thoroughly impressed. I think they've smashed it with this guy. I think he's, he's turned out amazing. I also hope you guys are enjoying the new update. I'm going to do my best to get a hold of a solid prisoner run to show off the new legendary form. Um, I found him a couple of times in like Acts 3 and 4, but I don't want to show you like like 10 to 15 minutes worth of legendary prisoner or even just prisoner in general. I want to try and get him in Act 1, as you know, which is easier said than done, but we'll see what we can do. Put that away. We're about to do battle. We're about to scrap. We're about to brawl. We're about to fight. Land of the Damned. Summon Macbeth. Summon Macbeth again. Lear. No, I don't care, Dad. I don't care. Lear. I'm gonna break this guy. More Lear. No, no, I don't care. I don't care. More Lear. Chance for another Macbeth. Macbeth. Look at the damage they're doing to him. They're bull. Oh my god. Yo, that's illegal. They did so much damage to him. Yo, Daddy, you got messed up. Alright, alright, ready, ready, ready. As soon as I can see damage. Graves. And now, and now, damage, damage. Wait, 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 wait. I need to swap. Activate Balrog. Balrog. Nah, I'll tackle with you, dude. Nah, get over here. Get over here. Look at him trying me. The tackle is actually, like, ruining his day. <laughs> the tackle's ruining his day. Big damage. Uh, it's about to run out. It's about to run out. As soon as it runs out, we swap. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Get the land of the damned. Summon King Lear. Summon Macbeth. More King Lear. Bullied. I took a lot of damage there just for, you know, because I don't care. But wow. Oh, my little dudes fall down with me. Good. Good. I see some gravestones ready. Sorry, tombstones. Gravestone, tombstone, same thing. Ready to be used. Nah, no, I don't care. I don't care. Think I care? Go ahead, do your worst. Oh! Macbeths! That was a big bit of damage right there. That was a licky, licky of damage. That was incredible. Well, there you go. I hope you guys enjoyed the Grave Digger run. One of the two new skulls introduced in 1.3. Uh, expect more. Um, I don't know if I'll do more Grave Digger and Monkey straight away, but I do want to get that extra prisoner run going for the new legendary effect and show off more of these new quintessences and new rooms. So look out for that. But with all of that said and done, I've got to get out of here. I hope you guys have enjoyed and I will see you all next time. Have a good one.